beauty? Today, we're going to talk about a hot topic related to our beloved Detroit Red Wings. The question many are asking is, is Jonathan Berger an exempt victim? I know this is a question that is on many fans' minds. Bergeron is a talented player, and we are all excited to see him in action in the NHL. But the eligibility and exemption rules can be a little confusing, right? Before we start, I want to ask you to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications, because we are bringing you fresh content every day. I can only expect this notion won't go over well with many fans but it looks as though Jonathan Bergeron may find himself as a waiver-exempt casualty in 2023-24. The Detroit Red Wings have a plethora of forwards set to make the opening night roster. With the team expected to carry three goaltenders to begin the year, a player like Bergeron, who doesn't need to be placed on waivers to be assigned to Grand Rapids, may, unfortunately, find himself skating with the Griffins for at least part of this upcoming season. Bergeron, 23, seemed like a sure bet to make the Detroit Red Wings roster this season following a very productive rookie campaign. Like any young player, Bergeron suffered his fair share of ups and downs but still managed to score 15 goals and a total of 28 points in 67 contests while averaging just over 13 minutes per game. Steve Iserman and the Detroit Red Wings enjoyed a very active summer, adding plenty of proven NHL-ready depth players to bolster their lineup, leaving a player like Bergeron, who can be sent down without waivers, leaving his immediate future with the team in question. Of course, Iserman also pulled off a blockbuster trade to land top-line scorer Alex Dabrinkit. In addition to Dabrinkit, the Red Wings added forwards JT Comfer, Clem Costin, Christian Fisher, and Daniel Sprong. Each of these players brings an extra element to Detroit's lineup, whether it is additional physicality, a role as a reliable checker, penalty killing, or depth on the power play in addition to playing as potentially a bottom six forward.